An assault style rifle at a child's soccer game has some parents not so happy tonight. Now, this security scare happened while the kids only five and six years old were in the middle of a game. Our Jasmine Payu joins us live from where this all happened with the story. Jasmine. Casey, that game happened right here at the Cardinals care field. The Southside Rec League holds games here in Fox Park, McKinley Park and Marquette Park. But thanks to that instance, no kids will be playing in this field from that league this weekend. The white lines, the short green grass, the gold post. It's not hard to recognize that this is a soccer field. It's the world's game. It brings people together. But to the community it serves, this piece of land means so much more. The first couple years we had 10, 15 people show up. Now we have over 150 people that come out to this field. And we hear consistently that how important this field is to this neighborhood. Tom Mickler is the co-founder of New Dimensions, the org that's over these youth soccer games. He says at their last game, something unexpected showed up on their turf. Parents on the sidelines witnessed uh, a couple of people uh, carrying guns. One was an assault rifle. The sight startling parents and some players, causing them to call a timeout on this weekend's game. It changed that moment because it's difficult to comprehend why that weapon would need to be at a five and six year old game at 915 on a Saturday morning. It happened at this Cardinals care field in Fox Park. Last week, five on your side showed you what can happen when people no longer feel safe and these playgrounds become playlists. Well, everybody know what they're doing and it's, it's not, you know, it's not fair to them. It's not fair to the kids. It's not fair to the community. Tom says the group is working with city leaders to make sure the soccer program is safe and enjoyable for everyone. But this mom and new dimensions coach says everyone has to play their position. You can't um, just shelter your kids. We, we have to, us parents and the community have to overtake the area and get off the sidelines. Today we asked Chief Hayden about this. He says there's not much they can do because open carry is legal in Missouri, but it's something he's hoping to change here in St. Louis City. As far as these games go, practices will continue October 7th, but games will start again Saturday, October 12th. Reporting live in St. Louis, Jasmine Payute, 5 on your side.